Here. So we're going to make a cocktail. Um, <sighs> I just made this up. Um, so here's yours, here's mine. Okay. All this stuff goes inside. So it's simple syrup and tequila. Okay. Uh, Do you want a little sweetness? Yes. The two Those clear two. ones. Yeah. So stick, stick that in. There's lime juice for the sour. There's uh, peach, fresh peach juice. It's the end of summer. Well, yes. you know, there's still a few peaches hanging around. Uh, yes, um, in Atlanta. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly, that's it. Uh, what is this again? So that is, um, it's a triple sec or okay. uh, an orange-flavoured liqueur. Okay. Okay, so dump that in. So like Grand then, Marnier in that exactly, world. Okay. Exactly, exactly. Stick a lid on and then give it a shake. Okay. Okay. And then I'm going to do one little fancy thing for you. Okay. So you can shake it however you want. I, I saw this in a Tom Cruise movie. <laughs> but it was more like this. <laughs> ah. He's very short. He's, He's little. Very, He's... very short, Tom Cruise. <laughs> okay. Okay, so pour your um, cocktail in over the ice. So we've okay. got crushed ice in there. Yes. And then I've got one last little thing. I've got a little lime that I've scooped out the actual uh, fruit of the lime. So it's yes. just the skin. And, and I'm sure got... you washed your hands so there's no COVID on the lime. There's no COVID. <laughs> There's a little rum going onto that. Okay. And then here's what you... If you You're want trying to give me drunk. Look how much liquor I have and how much you have. Okay, so now we light that up. Okay. Well, look how you make... Ooh, it's like a magic show for them. Ooh. And then get a little... Throw, throw the cinnamon on okay. top. It'll give you a little firework. Oh. Ooh, see that? Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, the great Arsenio. <laughs> <laughs> And then, if you like the rum, and I'm guessing you do, you just push that on in, and okay. there you go. Yes. Bon appétit. I like any liquor. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm from Cleveland, where in the hood we drink MD 2020. You know I like to drink. <laughs> That's almost like high-octane gasoline. It's not bad, right? This is amazing. Get a little rum. You do this as well as you cook. <laughs> well, thank you. All right, so now we're going to make pasta. Okay. So now that we've, you know, anything will taste good after that drink. But go ahead, pop the lid off. Okay. You're going to put in your semolina flour, your flour, and your water. Now see, when I used to cook for my son, I was afraid to do pasta because I never get it right. One time my pasta, it, it was like a, a, a Nestle's Crunch bar. You could hear, you know, <laughs> and I knew that was wrong when I heard my that's son wrong. crunching the pasta. Well, that's why I developed this machine just for you. Okay. So this does all the work for you. You pop that lid on. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's it's a very precise recipe. You're you're, you're good. Um, put your lid. Oh, put this flour. Yes. There you Little go. flour. Get the lid back on. Okay. Press it down. This is your thing. You. This is my thing. Yes. You heard about Arsenio's, right? <laughs> <laughs> I did, and I love it. So then you press it. You, you we we put in a double batch, right? Okay. So you press mix and you press start. Okay. It starts churning. And then I gave you water. I'm using spinach juice in mine. And you just pour it in there. Okay. And it does the mix for you. And then it'll actually extrude it as well. Okay. Well, now, why are you using spinach juice and I'm using water? Because um, just two different types of pasta. Oh, okay. This is going to give you a nice green pasta. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> yeah, you can. You can. You're... Why not? I'll drink to that. I'll drink to that. Mm -hmm. Add a little water to the drink and the flour. And the truth is you can make whatever kind of pasta you like. Okay, so now come on over here. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to get yours going. Okay. So now we hit extrude. So this is the same dough that you had over there. Yours is going to make penne. Mine's going to make angel hair pasta. Oh, So my. you see this beautiful penne here. This is easy to work, too, this machine. It's very, very simple. Where can I get this? Like, well, it's, it's easy for you, because I'm doing it for you. Yeah. But it's, um, you can get it at HSN. I sell all my kitchenware at HSN. OK. So everything you see, um, the, the cookware we're going to be using, so you can go to HSN and get it. So look, it comes out, right? Nice. And how's it taste? It, this is really good. <laughs> you got a little, little cut up. If those little worms are half as good as this. <laughs> So you can make it as long or as short as you want, right? Okay, okay. And we actually cheated, and just in case we spent too long on the cocktail, which mm -hmm. I thought we might. Right. Uh, but we've got this pasta. We're going to cook it in just a minute, but... We'll, we'll, we'll be right back. Uh, probably I should have broken for commercial earlier, but I'm drunk now. Okay. We're back with Chef Curtis Stone. Hey, I'm thinking the pastas that we made are soft, so unlike the stuff in the box, you probably never make crunchy pasta. You're not going to get crunchy pasta. And, and it cooks... This cooks in literally 60 seconds. Yes, and, and do you have, I noticed your pasta was thin, what do you call that kind of this pasta? This is angel hair. Yeah, and mine was... That's penne. 
How, how did you make the two machines do different pasta? Because they comes with eight different dyes, so it makes okay. fettuccine and lasagna, and it makes all sorts of different types of pasta. That's cool. That's pretty cool, right? Yeah. But so listen, it only takes 60 seconds, so we've got to make the sauce. Yes, sir. Okay, so let's get you some... Uh... I, I don't know if you should have started with this if you want me to make some sauce. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's get this cranking. Hey, man, how many restaurants you got in L.A. now? I've got two in L.A., uh -huh. uh, Morton Gwen, one in Beverly Hills and one in Hollywood and one in Dallas. Okay, so you're going to make a carbonara, okay. right? So you've got a little bit of pancetta okay. in there. Okay. Put some garlic and some shallots. And pancetta is like Beverly Hills bacon, it's right? It's fancy it's... bacon. Yeah, yeah. It comes from the belly. We put the, we put the um, egg yolks in here. Most people think of carbonara like it's a cream sauce, but it's right. actually not. So go ahead and whisk this up. Whisk those two things together. I love the word whisk. Whisk it, baby, whisk it. It kind of sounds like exactly what it does. Whisk. <laughs> I'm whisking. I'm putting a little brown butter in here. So I made this before, but all it is is butter that you throw into a hot pan. Now, and does brown butter come from Nubian cows? How do, how do you get, where do you get brown, <laughs> where do you get brown butter? It's a French thing, it's called bernoisette, right? So you put the butter into a hot pan uh -huh. and then the milk solids start to caramelize and it right. gets that beautiful nutty flavor. Right. You don't care at all, you're not even no, stirring. No, 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 no. <laughs> when I was raising my son, he almost <laughs> starved to death. <laughs> So this is, no, we're doing separate things. Oh, okay, right? okay. So what you're gonna, <laughs> what you're gonna do. Ain't he telling the truth. <laughs> I'm putting pine nuts and sage in with my brown butter, right? Yes. You're gonna um, take that pasta out and toss it straight into this bowl, oh, and okay. then you're gonna combine the whole thing. Now, if this is a comedy, like a Three Stooges episode, I would, ah! No, no, <laughs> so no, take the pasta out, yes. <laughs> I should use that. something. Use the lifter. Yes. Okay, I'm seasoning mine, I'm taking my angel hair out, Right, and you just pop it straight into that hot pan. Hey, you got basil leaves in yours. No, this is uh, sage. Sage, <laughs> yes. You know, simple. Yes. They're both green, they're both herbs. Yes. And then you just toss it. So the past, that beautiful fresh pasta, that does all the incredible work. The sauce can be very, very simple. That's it, that's it. <laughs> but you were supposed to put it into here, but it doesn't matter. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we're gonna, yes, yes. We're still... Hey, still you're gonna... the one that brought rum out here. <laughs> okay, stir it, stir it together. Okay. Stir it together. <laughs> I want to thank uh, Chef Curtis Stone. I also <laughs> want to thank Joe McHale. And I want to thank my friend Ellen for asking me to host and feeding me and giving me clothes. <laughs> <laughs> and I want to thank you all for watching. Have a great weekend, everybody. Bye-bye.